Check out all we did day one on Royal Caribbean's Oasis of the Seas. Got up, pulled back the curtains to a beautiful at sea day, and we headed off to breakfast. We chose Park Cafe in Central Park, much less crowded than the buffet, and I love their grab-and-go options, and they have specialty coffees in here. After breakfast, we headed up to the pool to check out our towels, which you need to do on Royal Caribbean ships, and headed into the adults-only solarium to enjoy some pool time. After that, we went to lunch at Portside Barbecue. There's a nominal fee to eat here, but it is so worth it. My husband was in total heaven and the food was delicious from start to finish. After lunch, we headed to the spa. We had booked the couple's one hour spa experience. This was only $99 and is so romantic and relaxing, highly recommend. Then we got dressed up for formal night, which was in the main dining room. I've been on tons of cruises. This main dining room food impressed me. After dinner, we went to the boardwalk for a spin on the carousel, grabbed some ice cream, then played a little bit in the casino. Then we went to Schooner's Bar to have a few cocktails and listen to live music. 